caught everyone by surprise. Hey there, diehard Dodgers fans. Welcome back to latest Los Angeles Dodgers news, your number one source for all things Dodgers. Today, we've got some hot news that could change the course of our season. But before I spill all the details, we're close to hitting our goal of a thousand subscribers. Help us achieve our dream by subscribing and showing the strength of Dodgers Nation. Thanks for the support! You know our team has been facing some challenges in the bullpen, especially after Ryan Brazier was moved to the 60-day injured list. Of course, the front office is on it and isn't going to take it lightly. According to a report from John Heyman of the New York Post, the Dodgers are eyeing a major boost for our pitching rotation. With the season heating up and the trade deadline fast approaching, the hunt for a reliable and efficient pitcher becomes even more crucial. Heyman revealed that the Los Angeles Dodgers are very interested in Miami Marlins reliever Tanner Scott. Does that name sound familiar? If not, get ready to know him better because he's having an impressive season. With a record of 5-5, 8 saves, and a 1.92 ERA over 28 innings in 27 games, Scott has shown why he's one of the best in the role. Despite a recent hiccup where he gave up a two-run homer, he has kept opponents to a batting average of just .140. A reliever like this would be a very valuable addition to our team. Now, the question you're dying to know, is Scott really coming to the Dodgers? After all, other World Series contenders are also in the race for Scott. But the answer is yes. With the Marlins out of playoff contention, the chance of negotiating a trade for this talent is real and close to happening. So, fans, what do you think? Is Tanner Scott the missing piece to take us to the title? Leave your opinions in the comments, we want to hear from you. And don't forget to leave a like, subscribe to the channel, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any updates about the Dodgers. The season is heating up, and we're going to follow it closely, together.